Victoria and Larry are in Dallas Fort Worth. We just came to the American flagship lounge. Uh, we've got a couple hours before our flight to London, so we're going to go check it out and we're going to walk around and we'll let you know how it goes. There are several American Airlines lounges in Dallas Fort Worth, and this flagship lounge is a big step up above American's Admiral's lounges. So if you qualify, make sure you visit the flagship lounge rather than one of the other lounges. Also, it may even be worthwhile to come to the airport a bit early. To gain access to this flagship lounge, you must have a first or business American Airlines flight between Dallas-Fort Worth or Asia or Europe or other locations. Because we have the business class seat to London, we qualified. At 25,000 square feet, the American Airlines flagship lounge in Dallas-Fort Worth is one of the biggest and best American Airlines lounges in the U.S., far bigger than the American Airlines Lounge we have visited earlier the day in Phoenix. That means better food and drink and more amenities you won't find in other lounges. This lounge has floor to ceiling windows overlooking the tarmac below. Soon after walking in, you see that the dining room with the modern chandelier and large couch has a great area to sit in and just relax. As you leave the dining area and continue back through the lounge, there's no shortage of seating. It's too hot to have a view in Terrace, but you can still watch planes come and go from the lounge. This lounge has an American flagship first dining located near the center of the lounge. This is a private dining facility inside the lounge, and it's only open to passengers flying in American's first class cabins. Here you can get a true restaurant quality sit down meal with made to order dishes and top notch wines and drinks. But our business class flight didn't qualify, so all I could do was look. For the business class passengers, there are two displays where you can dish up your own plates. They had cold bites, salads, meats, cheeses, and some sushi rolls. We arrived shortly before closing, so the selection wasn't tremendous. Towards the center of the lounge, there was also a bay of approximately 10 private shower suites, which you can reserve on a first-come, first-served basis. Each suite is qu equipped with its own shower, sink, mirror, toilet, and, well, pretty much everything you need to freshen up before or after a flight. There are some longer tables to get some work done, including a computer and printer available for use. I connected the lounge Wi-Fi and it found it fairly speedy. The toilets have bidets, something before this trip I'd never seen in a U.S. public restroom. The lounge has a large selection of both non-alcoholic as well as alcoholic drinks. They also have a handful of televisions, all turned to sports. Thank you for watching. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel for more travel-related videos.